In this video, we are going to be converting between fractions and decimals. My learning target is I can convert fractions into equivalent decimals to show both are equal parts to the same whole. So first, we're going to talk about converting a fraction to a decimal. First thing you need to do is to simplify if possible. Then you will divide the numerator by the denominator. If you are going to convert a decimal to a fraction, the place value of the decimal is the denominator of the fraction. So if it's the tenths, then it's like five tenths. If it's the 50, if it's zero, uh, 0 0.05, it's um, 0 0.0 and five hundredths, that would be five hundredths. Um, it, does, it just depends what place value it's in. And then the number on the right of the decimal point is the numerator. And you want to make sure you simplify if possible. All right. Um, so number one, we are going to simplify if possible. We can divide these both by two. Actually, we can divide these both by 12. So this is 1 half. So then we would do 1 divided by 2. So my decimal is 0 0.5 or 0 and 5 tenths. All right, so this is 0 0.3600, so we put 36 over 100, and then we would simplify if possible. So this is 9 25ths. This is 0 0.85 hundredths. Simplify. Seventeen twentieths. All right, we are going to simplify if possible, divide both by three, and we get. 2 fifths, then we do 2 divided by 5. So this is 0 and 4 tenths. Number 5. Simplify by 5, so we get 3 fifths, 3 divided by 5, oops, so 0 0.6 tenths. All right, this is 0 0.7 tenths, so 7 over 10. We can't simplify that anymore, so that's my answer. We will simplify these, divide by 4. Actually, we could divide by 8.
and then we will do one divided by three. So it looks like we're just going to get a repeating decimal. So this is 0 0.3 repeating. And then number eight, we have 12 one hundredths. And divide by two. Actually, we can divide by four. And that would be three twenty fifths.